here we go again and finally with more captain of industry what you're looking at now is a food processing facility we haven't built these yet and it's our first time in this amazing captain of industry a game so we're going to be needing some new food types for our population they are starving they are needing some protein and the best way to do that is a tofu you can use the eggs which we are producing but they're not producing fast enough they're good old chickens so we are doing beets and tofu so what you see is the facilities it's a food processing plant and what that needs is soybeans it also needs a limestone it also needs sulfur and water and that will produce our tofu so stick around and you'll be able to see it come to life Welcome, welcome and we're back everyone. It is good to be back and we're back here with Captain of Industry for another short and quick episode and this time we're going to focus on a well, food again because our population needs a food. So, oh, and we've got our ships coming in. Check it out. We've just come back off for battle and we actually have lost that battle. That'll be alright. We'll get straight back into it. How cool is that? And you can see we've got a few or a new port over there we haven't utilized yet. We've got quite a bit that we've done between episodes. We are greatly, greatly uh, making a big hole here in the iron mine, as you can see, uh, which is pretty cool. But there's still plenty left, and I'll show you that in a moment. Our docks are getting, getting there. They're getting to where we want them to be. As you can see, we've built another port ready to rock and roll. Now, what we're going to do over, so over here today, we are going to expand our food production because our population keeps going up like a yo-yo or roller coaster due to the fact that we don't have enough protein-based food. We come over to our food uh, houses over here we're only getting the occasional eggs in. So we're going to make some tofu today. That's our focus. Uh, but we'll quickly show you what we've done. So here is our city's slightly growing. Now I've kept these gaps here because I'm going to move these towns over to here. And we're going to put in some decorative or decorative. Uh, the square light or square dark, square fountain or square with columns. So that's going to be pretty cool. Uh, we are now researching our next tier tech lab equipment number three so we're slowly going through the tech space there which is again pretty cool because we need lots of power that's our big focus I'm going to give it a bold pause at the moment we need to get into some more power we really need to get nuclear to be honest we are needing to expand we need water so we've been out exploring and we've found it over here groundwater we need to use one of those new ports to bring in water because we are low on water and we need water to really increase the size of our power plant, which is not really big uh, considering. So we're sort of on the verge. Uh, I'm going to have to shut down some things potentially to get the food production up and running, but we'll see how we go. Uh, so I haven't really done anything new over here. Uh, all I've done is really got some base infrastructure ready for the tofu now tofu we go over to our tofu production which will be the food process i'm just going to dump it over here we're going to have a pretty a good look here we need water soybeans sulfur and limestone for tofu limestone for tofu so and that's going to produce a couple of things. Well, we need animal feed because our chickens are pretty much starving at all times. And it's going to make 12 tofu. Probably put two of these to get started. We probably only need to utilize one. Uh, so I have at the moment our production of limestone. We already need it over here at... Where do we need our limestone? We needed it here to produce our fertilizer too. Now we've got plenty of sulfur, so that will be all pumped up this conveyor all the way up the back here 
and bingo. So let's get started and our tofu is producing over here. So there's been some pretty cool updates uh, or slow updates uh, pretty much coming through from the development team. This is an early access version, but it is getting a better all the time. Again, a big shout out to them. They are doing an awesome job. So we're going to need to get our food processor going to get two of those now my goal is here and these sections here now i sort of left these for later i'm just going to place it down again to show you to make our chicken carcasses water salt into meat but we're not going to do that today because we are going to have lots of chicken carcasses ready to rock and roll over here so we are going to do it on this side now i don't think i need much of a gap Something like that should do the job. Now, we'll pause you for now. We don't need you. And let's hook it all in to get this going. And hopefully, now the only thing I'm not sure, now I've got a conveyor bringing these eggs down, but because we're not producing too many eggs, even if we open up the four, up to four, this conveyor belt can pump out 200. So I'm going to utilize the same conveyor to bring back our tofu. So we only need really conveyor two. So my goal is to make an infrastructure backbone of this tofu. Probably get you to come back here for now. Just put it across there in case we bring another one. We can then use flat conveyor one to pretty much just go up here. You're up to there. Beautiful. That'll bring the tofu onto our conveyor. Now we need to get the feed out. So again, we could probably do that underneath. Yeah. Oh no. <laughs> I was excited. We can't get in there. That's a pain. Oh, we can, we can, we can, we can. But we can't go underneath. What's in the way? Are you kidding me? Oh, no, no, we got it. We got it. Bingo. We'll quick can deliver these small belts and then just let the trucks focus on the... Food processor. Cool. Now water. Now water. We have water here. So again, water is a problem. I'm just going to pump this up here for now. And I'm hoping we can somehow get water to as neat as we can. Yeah, I thought they were going to be a bit close. Now, I might leave that one for now and focus on these conveyors. Uh, now, the hardest one is going to be this one. Maybe we focus you. No. How are we going to get? That works. To... But we need to bring in. That won't work. So let's pause for a moment again. Uh, so we need to bring in the soy. Now the soy. Where is the soy? I don't have any soy. Oh, I said it's there. It is there. No, that's not it. That's going to be it. Okay. So it's all the belts. So we need to use all these three belts. So we don't need to use that other input. So this will work. Yes, 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 yes. As long as we don't get in the way of the water. So that means you will be able to go up there. Brilliant. Nice. That's actually really good. All right. Fantastic. 
All right, so then we just need to get you. That's fantastic. And perfecto. All right, that is actually brilliant. So let's let's uh, pump all these open. What have we got? 46. You we're losing a bit of unity at the moment. Why is that? I wonder. Have we started something we don't need to produce? Pretty much everything is good. Oh, we don't need this. We've got another oil going up here. Hmm. Didn't even know. Okay. Are they at all capacity? They are at capacity. Okay. We might pause you. I'll tell you why we'll pause you. I'll show you. Oop, pause. I'll show you why. Because over here, we are now chockers with fluid. That's something I didn't show you. Check it out. So we now have nearly our full distill uh, or refinery going. Check it out. All these are all the stages. We're nearly full capacity. Absolutely chugging it out. So what's happening is we had an overflow. I know it's a bit noisy there. We had an overflow of uh, naphthalene. So what I ended up doing is, and fuel. So what I've done is we utilize the overflow of fuel to pump over here to some cracking units. And the cracking units then produced more naphthalene, which then we pumped it through our cracking units again to produce gas. So we basically reverted it because we're getting too much naphthalene, uh, sorry, fuel. And we weren't utilizing all the fuel. So, but we needed gas. So we needed to convert the fuel, the diesel, back to naphthalene. Uh, and then the naphthalene could be utilized to make more gas. And that's why you can see this is we're at capacity. So there you go. That actually is working really well now. And we're still pumping out the fuel, as you can see. All right, how are we going? How are we going? You're in the wrong direction, so toggle you. Toggle you. All right, we are building. This is it, this is it. Oh, we need to get you open here. We'll just get some water going on. All right, we need you to produce. We will now get the second one built, even though we might not utilize it. How much power? Only 25. So temporarily, we're not going to have much water. So I'm going to come up to our water production and put in another one. Just because we do need it. Great uh, you, quick deliver. And we'll put you in there. All right. Even though I don't really want to utilize this water, but for now, that'll at least get our production going. All right. Where is our first? Here it comes. Our first, that's tofu. Make sure everything functions fine here. No, yes, no, yes. Oh, yes, 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 yes. Our first tofu production. So we have eggs, we have tofu, and we're going to follow this down while the other one builds and make sure that food did oh no it's not going to come up because we did not do the food we need to put make sure oh man I can do that all right that hopefully will now build up and that will be some more food coming off the line beautiful And plenty of tofu and soy 
beans come in off the line. Sometimes I feel like I'm on a farming sim. If you haven't come and checked it out, come and check out one of our farming sim streams. We have a live server that runs uh, and quite a few of us are on there at the moment. A few other uh, collaborating with a few other um, creators and we're having a ball on farming sim. Um, and that's what it feels like right here. We're doing soybeans on the farm. We're doing all kinds of things with the animals and feeding the animals. So that's pretty cool fun. If you haven't actually played farming sim, highly recommend it. We're actually looking for some more farmers to jump on the farm. So if you do want to join up uh, into the Discord, I can direct you to where we have a farming sim Discord. And you can join the team and have a chat to the team. And, and we might actually get you live on the farm because we need more workers on the farm. And you'll be on the stream, so it's pretty exciting. Um, and I normally stream that on the weekend. So uh, come check it out and definitely go check out the Discord if you're interested in joining the team. Let's speed that up and uh, we'll get the soy and see how that's going to work down the other end. Pumping it out. Alright, what are we? We're missing food. But that should slowly increase now that we're going to have these both functioning. But we're not going to have an issue with protein now. Where's our first... Soy production. Or tofu, isn't it? Is it here? No, we haven't actually got to there yet. So that pretty much comes around here. What I do need to do is delete this now. This splitter is no longer needed because I brought down a separate line. So I'm hoping this will go into here. This will now be tofu pretty sure there should be able to go straight in there's our first tofu right there I think on oh no, that we've got some more oh, that's the bread Come on. We'll just go uh, pop another tofu. We should have enough power. Make sure they're all pumping off the line. Absolutely awesome. Pumping out that tofu. These guys at the... That's it. Making sure everything's connected. All fine. That should go through there. Fantastic. All right. Is it going in yet? Not yet. Come on. Where is it? Where is it? Still a bit off. It's got a bit of distance to travel. Chicken need food. Well, you should be good. Could not store all potatoes. Could not store all vegetables. Well, that's a good sign, isn't it? And people are getting happy here. Look, 2.15. So hopefully uh, this tofu will fix up that issue. That's a couple of other things. We're actually running... We'll slow that down. We've actually got a... I've got the wall built here for our huge... It will be a huge uh, copper here. Now, what we've got to be careful of is not allowing the water to come in. So, we're going to have to be really careful how we dig down across. But as you can see, we're coming to an end there. Uh, we're okay. We're not too bad here, but we've dug quite far down. Some walls collapsed here. So, again... Something that I'd really love the developers to do is to build some or to have much deeper walls. And I'm sure that'll come. I'm sure there's plenty of every or people actually requesting that feature. This is our waste management down here. We're dumping into this lake all our waste, which is uh, cool. Alright, Tofu, where are you? Bit of a worry. Our maintenance looks like we need to boost as well. So there's lots of small little tasks that need to be done. 
But again, a very simple episode, just getting our tofu running so then I can now focus on expanding population without them getting too upset and focusing on getting that water in through the water uh, well. And then that'll allow me to boost up my power and I can start getting into some of the juicy stuff. So let's see what happens. Yeah, there it goes. Absolutely brilliant. And this should bring our protein production up. Yeah, this is what we want. Fantastic. Also, that's going to allow us to produce more eggs because our food will go through. So between the bread, which makes food, we've also got an extra mixer here off the excess wheat to make food. These uh, chickens are going to be very, very happy. So that's it. That's all. It was just a simple episode on food production. It's quite actually a pretty neat, pretty neat, pretty uh, found a good spot for that. We can expand that quite easily. Always leave a bit of space for expansion. Yeah, you could say I didn't hear, but you don't need much space. As long as you get the conveys at the right levels. So I've got the highest on the water. You've got your soy coming in on the second level. And then on the third level there, we've got the uh, limestone. And on the base, we've got the uh, good old sulfur. It's going to be interesting how long that lasts for. Oh, we're going to have to fix that up as well. There's a few little things I've got to fix. Population's going down, but that is the episode. Thanks, folks. Short, sharp, and sweet. I did say that. And I'll see uh, what else. That's it. So, oh, just to the next, skip over to what we're going to do next. So once I fix all that water uh, problem, we're going to water problem, and now we're going to fix the population. Well, we just fix that by having more food. We're going to expand all of these. It's going to be our biggest focus to Blast Furnace 2. Pretty much, I've got everything we need for Blast Furnace 2 in the area, so which is fantastic. So it's pretty much just slowly integrate, just basically get it happening. So that will be a massive uh, task at hand to do that. Uh, but that's pretty much it. Ladies and gentlemen, like always, I will see you all on the other side.